Hey y'all, it's Costume Jeweler. Guess where we are? Second Street in Frisco, Texas. Going in here looking for purses. Designer handbags for resale on YouTube. So make sure you hit that notification bell. Click all. Make sure that bell turns black so you don't mess out on my live buy it now's auctions, giveaways, and these video uploads. Subscribe to the channel and thumbs up for this video. My favorite store, there's three locations. One in Frisco, Texas, Deep Ellum, downtown Dallas, and then I think off Lower Greenville in Dallas. So a huge store, huge store, and they've got tons. We're not gonna get to see everything. We're gonna try to see as much as we can. As much as we can, ladies. Oh, look at this one right here. I love this one. Bifold wallet. Lots of Louis Vuittons. We love our Louis. Louis Vuitton change purse. Here's a bifold wallet. I don't have a Louis Vuitton wallet. It's 149. Wonder if that's worth getting. They're gonna have lots of jewelry too. Got some Tiffany and Company. It's a cool pearl necklace right there. I like that. $19.90. What? $19. That's a really good deal, I think. I think it is. Gucci keychain. I love this store, y'all. Love it. Ignore me and the camera, but look at all that. This Gucci card case right here. I don't have a Gucci wallet either. Look at this one, y'all. Oh, there's a Goyard right there at the back. Fendi. Cute Fendi clutch. Oh, look at this Brahmin, y'all. Celine Paris. Hermes credit card case right there, y'all. Look at that. Gosh, I love this store so much. My favorite in Dallas, y'all. Look at this coach. Michael Kors. Very cool wallet. Tom Ford snake wallet right there at the back. And look at all this, y'all. There's so many bags that just make you dizzy. Make you dizzy, dizzy, dizzy. There's so many. I love that one. I better just go in order, huh? Pretty decent condition. And they're going to have lots of clothing in here, too. And I'll show you. We're not going to look at the clothing. We're focusing on the purses and any jewelry. This is a real snake coat, y'all. Look at that. This is real snake skin. See how it's kind of raised right there? Wow. Martin Jacobs, what is this one? Fur. Burberry again. Michael Kors. Tory Burch. Oh, this is a pretty Kohan. Look at this one. It's got the calf hair. Speaking of calf hair, I saw Bob last night. I honked. This is my course. I honked and Bob was there within three minutes. Gucci.
Ignore my face, y'all. We're looking at purses. Trying to show you some of them up close. Without the glare, hence the word trying. So the Dallas designer handbag place is right around the corner from here. Did a very short video on that today, just of the outside because they won't allow you to video. I'm gonna look at the ones on the top racks now to see what they are. Philip Lim. This is kind of funky fun. Is this a coach right here? I don't think I've ever bought a Bagley Michka before, but look at this one, y'all. This one is super cool. I like it. I think I'm going to get it. I think I am going to get it. It's in great condition. And I just love that look. I mean, it's the worst. Freaking crazy. And I'm telling you, ADD will get the best of you in here. Is that a Brighton? What is this? What is this? What is it? Is it sterling silver? There's no price on it. I'm telling you, you talk about adrenaline rush. We'll get back to these in a minute. Still have a little bit of jewelry, but mainly purses. Mainly purses, ladies. Who is that? This one's Everest, Brighton. I'm gonna try to show you everything best I can. Salvador Vergamo. Oh, look at this Brighton. She's pretty. This is a very nice Brighton. I love the way that one looks. I wish Florida would hurry up and get one of these already. My gosh. You will fall in love. You will fall in love. I like this bag a lot. I don't know that I'm going to get it though. I'm getting that bag. Lay Mexico. What is this? Dooney. A little Dooney. How cute are you, sweetie? Look at you. You're so pretty. You're so pretty. You are beautiful. What's this black one here? B. Mikowski. Now this right here is a super unusual B. Mikowski. Look at this one, y'all. Tory Burge. Another Brighton. Oh, what is this? Looks like ostrich. It's a Nine West ostrich. Now look at this coach right here. And it's not coach, it's this one right here. Never heard of that. It looked like coach to me based on the hardware. But have y'all ever heard of that brand before at all? Look at these, y'all. I mean, they're everywhere. You will spend hours. Mad Rabbit Kicking Tiger. Huh. Well, Mad Rabbit. Let's see what you're all about, you bundle joy, you. Your handle's a little bit warm, but I'm kind of liking you, Mad Rabbit. Just a little bit. And even though these handles are a little bit worn, y'all, I am in love with this bag. And if you did see anything that I pecked up, I'm in Texas and I'm probably going to ship it back to myself so I can have a sale. We're going to get this Mad Rabbit. I mean, my gosh, you just got to get it based on the name, right? What is this one here? Oh, I love you too. You're so pretty. You're so pretty. What brand are you, sweetie? Sandra Roberts, SR. Little fancy Vince Camuto, look at that. So they color code here, all that good stuff. You really gotta look at the brands because some of these might be a hidden gem. Ever heard of that one before? Jimmy Choo. I'm telling you, it's designer purse heaven, second street, three locations. You don't want to miss it if you're in Dallas visiting. 
You want to come by here? What is this? Is this another B. Mikowski? I don't know. This is Amy Kestenberg. Great brand right there. Also, what's this one? Brooks Brothers. I love this one too. Fancy Rebecca Minkoff. Look at that, y'all. That's a pretty one too. And then every rack has clothes and shoes. Brighton and Zach Posen. Now, what do y'all know about this brand here? Zach, P O S E N. So, Zach Posen. You know what this one is? Paloma. Paloma Picasso. Great condition, kind of a blue color. Y'all saw the white one that I thrifted. I don't know if I'll get that one or not, but y'all saw the white one I thrifted at the thrift store. Ooh, kitty cat. Y'all, look at this. Look at this leather bag right here. I don't know if I'll get this one or not, but it's super cute. Here's the brand on this one. Never heard of that either. Another very nice Brighton bag. But this little kitty cat right here, I like that. What do y'all think about that one? So yeah, on every top rack, purse after purse after purse. Cute little simple bucket bag crossbody. Russet. And that's a first for me. Rebecca Minkoff. I think you can never go wrong with her, y'all. Have I seen this one before? Hunting World. I swear I've seen that brand before. It's called Hunting World New York. I think I have seen that before, I'm not sure. Kate Spade. Oh, this one's bad. Bad, 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 what is this? I'm just gonna say this. It's not really a complaint, it's an observation. I would not put this in here for sale. It's just a tote. It's just a Jeep tote. I would not put that in here for sale at all. I can't imagine that that's going to go anywhere. But you never know. Crazier things have happened. Crazier things. Ooh. Wow. So is that meant to be like that? Butterflies on it. I love this bag. I think it's kind of like a fairy tale bag. Look at this, y'all. Bagley Michka butterflies on it very different tote we may have to grab this one up I love that one golly I do Chew beautiful leather bag this is Maurizio Teuti let's see if you can see that right there it's a good looking tote too Kate Spade uh oh, another fun one. A little frog needs to be sewn back on. Oh wow, look at that. Another cutie patootie. Beautiful, beautiful. Mm -hmm. This one's called Portland Leather Goods. So yeah, if you see anything you think I picked up, shoot me an email, I'll give you a price quote. Hopefully I'm taking these back to Florida with me and not leaving them at the Airbnb. I think we're gonna get this one, Portland Leather Goods. This is in great condition and I love the look of that so much. So far stash, so far stash. Not sure if this is worth getting, but look at this y'all. This is Donald Pliner. Look at this, calf hair. Yeah, Bob was, I honked last night, and Bob was there in two minutes. Look at that. Pliner, Pliner, love that look on this one. Don't know if I'll get it yet or not, but we'll think about it as we walk around. What is this one here? Oh, 
Here's the brand on this one, y'all. Now, I might be in love with this one. Look at this. Just the way that looks. Another new one for me. Oh, how are you? Well, I'm doing well. How are you? Italy. Rick Dog. And look at that. I'm going to have to think on this one, too, because this is just a super cute bag right here. Look at that. Hmm. What do y'all think? Got a little bit of rub right there. We'll think about that one. That's still a cute bag. Gosh, decisions, decisions. Why? This is Sheen. S-H-E-I-N. Calvin Klein. It's kind of a... See right here, look at all this. Might as well hit these rows too as we go. Another bucket bag. Is that a blue coach? Martin Jacobs. Canteen, oh, that's a cute one. Now that's nice. Canteen bag, look at this, y'all. Another Rebecca Minkoff. Michael Kors, that's different. Coach. This is a designer bag overload, isn't it? Brighton. They've got a lot of Brighton in here. Very nice pieces. Another nice Rebecca Minkoff. Oh, wow, okay. Have y'all heard of this before? I've had it once. So this is one of those brands that's worth picking up too. I don't know that I'll get this, but look at that. It's missing the shoulder straps or the crossbody shoulder. That's a good looking bag your star bag if you're a star what is that another tote I don't understand that is this a Brahmin is you a Brahmin right here and it is look at that y'all mm-hmm hello every now and then I run onto a shoe that's kind of unusual look at this one Tico, love that. Look at that, y'all. What do you think about that? You want to run out and get it. That's what you think. I know. I know. You ain't telling me nothing. Coach. Oh, vintage red coach. Look at that stitching on that one. And look at this calf hair right here. Oh, my gosh. All leather. Mm-hmm. Yoakum, Texas, branded with quality, all leather. And I do believe that this must go home with CJ. Look at that beautiful bag right there, y'all. Wow to the wow to the wow. Let's put that down in here, our little, our little section here. Why not? Got a Rebecca Minkoff pebbled. Ooh, this is, I wonder if this is leather. Let me take these up to the counter, y'all, because we're getting overloaded. Look around, y'all. Look around. Gosh, we ain't even done yet. I'd like to show y'all fancy shoes when I see them. Look at these. Look at all this. Did I even look up here? Fendi, $2.99. I mean, every top rack is full. I'm your personal shopper, don't forget that. You just have to hit me up quick on these purses before I put them in inventory. Okay, I like you, you big green yellow, big green tote. Here's the branding on this one. 
So we're going to think about that one. That's a Madewell tote, and those are Madewell, and they are expensive. But we're going to think on that one. What is this? Steve Madden. Steve Madden looking like a biker tote a little bit. What's this one here? Is this for teachers? I don't know either. Coach is very nice. You ever heard of that before, Jill by Jill Stewart? I haven't. I'll tell you what, I haven't been down to the ones, and I'm gonna try to take these back with me to Florida, the ones I buy, so I can bring them for sale to you. But I'm not sure. I'm hoping to hit the ones in Dallas on my way back Friday and I may not be able to carry all those purses with me because I've got to ship them. Well, I don't have to ship them Friday because I'm flying them to the Southwest Plane. Nina Ricci. Not only does she have perfume, she has purses. Sold her perfume a lot and I think I'm going to get this one, y'all. The light kind of washes it out so it's a fancy red your signature there it's a nice bag and I love this part right here on the leather so I am going to get this it is clean that Nina Ricci is clean okay beautiful bag how are you doing you're doing okay me too so what are you tell me what you are there's the brand right there I'm liking this one a lot but I don't know about that mark right there I don't know if that would come out Think on it, Kate Spade. Travel on. Cuccinelli. What's this big old beautiful bag right here? Just a huge tote. Toff and Lodstrom. Girls and boys, eat your hearts out. Look at this. Eat your hearts out. I have never seen a Patrician Ash looking this sexy. Looking this sexy, my goodness. Girl, who told you that you ain't the queen? Who? We're getting it. We are getting it. You know, I'm a sucker for the black bags with the chains. I'm a sucker for chains, baby. The first time I came into a second street, I was with my friend Diane. Look at this Michael Kors, y'all signature series with my friend Diane and man that poor girl I think I wore her arms out I had so many purses her and Kim both what is this one here oh, look at you Miss Tassel there you go isn't she beautiful oh this is real snake skin and snake skins in in 2024 from what I read what I heard. This one is not branded, y'all, but that's a good looking bag right there. Look at that up close. What do y'all think about that one? Y'all know I like Lucky Brand a lot. Look at this one, y'all. This is a butterfly, huge tote, but look at how pretty this is. Look at that. I like it. And we are gonna get that one for sure. We are, we are. My gosh. I have to do a haul video with them. This is ridiculous. Vera Bradley solid colors. Y'all know we love those. Oh, another bright and that's pink. And it looks like it's ready for springtime. I wonder if that butterfly was around it. Close your eyes. Fancy, have y'all ever heard of this? Green. It's kind of pretty. 
not branded on the inside, but I believe it to be leather. But look how pretty this is, y'all. It's a crossbody and a shoulder bag. And that is gorgeous. What do y'all think about that one? I think we need to put it in our pile. Coach, coach. Another leather black tote. I love these. This is that Portland leather goods bag again. I'm going to carry this in around and think about it. I think I might just go ahead and get it. This is a nice little handbag crossbody. It's a big Kate Spade. Y'all, we're getting this one. Look at this. This is a huge, huge Consuela tote. Look at those handles. Wow. Oh my gosh, and it's zipper top. Biggest Consuela tote I've ever seen in my life. Might as well give you a play-by-play -play after each aisle. Look at this, y'all. Now we're taking all these to the front. Oh my gosh. See all these right here? We haven't even gotten to those yet. What is this one here? 29 leather. What is that? What's around corner door number one? This is a fossil. You can tell by looking. Look at all those. Oh, it's not a fossil. Is it? No. What? It is a fossil. It's a pretty good looking one. Not sure if I'll get it or not. We might. We might, if I remember at the end, I've already got probably 10 purses up there. What is this beautiful Latoe Red Haw? What are you, cute pie? This is a fun, funky tote called Bohemians, and I like it because it looks hippie-ish. Free-spirited. Look at that. I'm liking it, y'all. I'm liking it. I'm liking it a lot. Never heard of that brand. There's a lot of Oh, come on now. Why you got to do this to me? Why? Look at that. Why you got to do this to me? You little Southwestern beauty. You see, this is make sure that if you ever see a mirror bag, you get it. We're getting this one. Miss Mira, you're going home with CJ, baby. You are beautiful. I think the girls will love you too. Austin Reed. A first for me on that. Sometimes if I don't know them, I don't get them, Kipling. But I look them up. Betsy Johnson. Coach, Coach. Kate Spade. Mark Jacobs. Here's the brand on this. D-I-A-V-E-L. And look how fun this is, y'all. All those colorful spikes. I don't know if we're going to get it or not, but I like it. I want to show it to you, whether I'd get it or not. Good looking Brighton right there, crossbody. This is Furla. Metallic flower bag. Ooh, this Kate Spade's nice. Look at this one, y'all. Wonder if that's real ostrich. I think that this, this is real ostrich. Probably worth getting red and white. Maybe, we'll see. We will see. Not certain. That'd be a nice beach tote. This one's Manny Puri. M A N I P U R I. Never heard of it. 
Oh wow, look at this, y'all. Look at this. Curly the flat cat. Some people are gonna go berserk over this one. And guess what, ladies? I'm packing it up. I'm getting it. I'm getting it. Oh my god, this is gonna be the biggest purse haul from Second Street in a long time. I'm super excited. Case spade. Cuba. Another good brand right there. I like Cuba. I think it's an awesome brand. Two-tone brown, all leather. Good condition, no rubs. Can't tell here, but but I think we're gonna get that one, ladies. We're gonna take that Cuba home. Just keeps piling up. Why? Antique Craft is another good brand if you ever find it. In my humble opinion, ladies. This is another fossil. It is not, that's a Vera Bradley. I've seen this before, this brand. I'm gonna show it to you. I don't remember if it's a good brand and worth pecking up or not. Y'all tell me in the comments below. But this is Coco Fiori. Is it or is it not? I'm gonna put it back for now, but I'm gonna remember, hopefully remember, to come back and look at it again. Carolina Herrera, come on girl. Bring it. Bring it. Now y'all take a look at this beauty right here. Carolina Herrera, all leather. Yummy. Yummy. What's this one? It's got some rubs on it. I know nothing about this brand right here, but I'm gonna tell you what, this is so stinking cute that I'm just gonna take it home because of that. It's purple. There's your little puppy dog. So cute, look at that. Why am I putting them on the floor, you ask? Because they don't have shopping carts. Is the floor dirty? Nope, it's clean. 2B by Agnes, I figured I'd just nip that in the bud right now or anybody else says anything about it because we've had that happen before. We have. Is this worth getting, y'all? Because I swear that's a perfume. Is that a perfume or what? And then a little break for clothes. I'm not going to really look at them. This just gives you an idea of the beautiful things they have. Look at these shoes. Now look at this big Gucci, y'all. This is a big Gucci right here. This is a big one. I think this might be to carry your suit in. Wow. You could use it as display also. That's what I do with the Louis Vuitton that I've got. I do need some boots. Cause I'm, me and Dow Stars tomorrow are going to be, um, putting stakes down for the 74 pecan trees. But I may just wear these instead. Dow Stars would just pass out. She would pass out. Look at these Doc Martens, y'all. Wow. Wow. Let's see what they've got over here. So they've got a little bit of everything. Let's see if the men have anything fantastic. I don't know if they will or not. Porter, I've just never heard of that either. And then selection of men's clothes. Men's clothing selection. Be a Martin Jacobs, please. 
This one is Rag and Bone, y'all, and that's a good brand too. And I'm gonna think about this one. This is a crossbody, and look at that. Yeah, I'm gonna think on that one, Rag and Bone, baby. Don't forget Rag and Bone, Porter again, Tokyo, Japan. What do y'all think about all these? Ooh, this is the Fry Company. Great bag right there, I love it. Dunhill, London. That's what I need, it's another duffel, but I don't want a new one. It's a big one though, for 23. I don't think I can get all my purses in there though. Over in the men's section, you still should check for the purses, but you're gonna get some other stuff too. And Vestuni, all orange, minimal damage. I should take the time to look. Okay, here we go again. Hunting World, I swear I've had that before. But I should look at the men's clothing sometime, because you never know. Best store ever. Preloved bags. Always look to see if they get any men's briefcases. It's Mark and Graham. There's the Porter brand again. I've just never heard of that at all. What is this camouflage bag? Very nice coach crossbody. Um, it's like computer bag. But yeah, Porter, never heard of Porter. Note to self, check the other bags, see if I want them. Look at this big beautiful blue Brahmin right here, y'all. And then you have this Martin Jacobs. This one's huge, great condition too. Kind of an orange color, if you can tell. Always th I think of Michael Kors when I see Martin Jacobs, but I like Martin Jacobs better. This is a Lexus Hudson snake bag. Kind of a burgundy wine maroon color. Hmm. Look at this coach. Guess what this one is? Salvatore. Paragamo. Look at this one, y'all. What year? What year is this? Very fancy. Another Martin Jacobs coach. What is this colorful one here? What are you? Oh, Gwen Stefani's label, y'all. I forget what LAMB stands for, but it's her label. This is a fun one. This is a fun one. Look at this. I call this kind of a graffiti purse. Rebecca Minkoff. Looks fancy to me. Looks fancy to me. There's that porter again. Definitely learn about these brands together. Because, what is this one? Mira, maybe? It is. And we're getting it. Look at that. All calf hair, wristlet. It's 
solid bear Bradley. That's a good looking crossbody right there. If I were gonna pick one up, it would be that one for sure. Look at this one, y'all. Look at that coach. We are getting it. We are, we are. We're gonna think on this one just because it's got a little bit of an issue right there, but still great condition. But I don't know yet. Look at that Michael Kors, wow. Another Russ that I've gotta figure that one out. Mark by Martin Jacobs. Beautiful coach. Zari. Bright orange. Fendi. What? Little itty bitty. What's this one right here? Oh, Chino. Burberry. Fry's also a good brand, MCM. Antique craft beaded bag. Kate Spade, I don't know why I missed that one. Prada. Never seen a Brahmin like this one, y'all. Look at this. That bag is Celine. Plan C. So, no haul video at the end because I show things as I pack them up. And sometimes I change my mind at the end. But y'all saw it. It's a major haul today here. I look through these wallets. Let's see if there's any treasures. But yeah, Second Street, y'all. It is the place to shop. I promise you, if you're in Dallas, do it. Kate Spade. Stone Mountain. Brighton, look at that Brighton, y'all. Dooney. Dooney and Burke. Oh my gosh, look at this owl wallet. How cute is this? And this is Kate Spade owl wallet. Must we get it or not? Beautiful red coach wallet. Cute credit card wallet. I'm not sure the brand, but it's Honey Bee. I like that, it's a pretty color. Good brand right here, Bisconti. Bisconti. I know that's a good brand, how do I know? I just do. Pinky and Diane. Amy Kestenberg. Don't forget that name. This one's like new. Look at the inside, y'all. 
very cool wallet here. Look at this, it's a Velcro. And when you open it up, there you are. Very nice. Small coach wristlet, our favorite color, red. In addition to visiting family, I've been trying to bring y'all videos. We won't have them probably every day right now until I get back to me. But I will try. Love this wallet too. Can't tell what the brand is. Looks like L-E-V-O-A-N. But what do y'all think about that one? I like it. I like the owl and I like that one. And the net. I kind of like it, y'all. So it's a credit card wallet. And it's that fancy brand that's expensive. Have all the credit card slots inside. Never heard of it. Paul Smith wallet right there, y'all. Expensive. Expensive. Let's see these. I like these black wallets. It looks like a coach. I like them when they're like that. And it is. Look at that. Pretty little black coach right there. We're going to check that one out. Check it out. Check it out. Okay, I think we're to the end, y'all. So don't forget to like, subscribe, share, hit that notification bell, click all. And until next time, thank y'all for watching and supporting the channel. And we'll see y'all later. We're nearly to 24,000 subscribers. Bye.